against our oath we have left we have let Senator Malala, who was supposed to go to Nairobi uh, province, Nairobi area, is now on his way to Mumias. Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, it is you, and I'm looking at you. It is you, Mr. Speaker, who has been defied. And Mr. Speaker, if you cannot sit on that seat, this will be a good time to resign. I can sit there. <laughs> because this is a chamber of parliament. It is to an extent, Mr. Speaker, you have such powers that if there was a vacancy in the executive, Mr. Speaker, you could, you could be a president. And for even a rumor, Mr. Speaker, that you're under pressure. I hear you're under pressure. Pressure from who? Did God call you? Did you speak to God this afternoon, Mr. Speaker? It's who is pressurizing it, 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 you? It's good you said it's a rumor. Yes. Because I'm, I'm not under any pressure. <laughs> Mr. Speaker, if you are not under any pressure, and nobody has called you, Mr. Speaker, this session must end. Now, because if you gazetted a special sitting, Mr. Speaker, and somebody distributed sanitizers, and that is a misdemeanor. It's a misdemeanor to the extent, Mr. Speaker, we would have paid for a bond, would have finished this business, and Senator Malala would have been charged even if they wanted to take him to Somalia or Kakuma. Mr. Speaker, there has never been a day since your election that you are under trial. It's not us. We have done our bit. If you can issue a directive seated in your, cha in your chair, and Mr. Speaker, somebody says he's on leave. Imagine what would happen, Mr. Speaker, if the car that is driving Senator Malala at high speed rolls somewhere in Ivasha. God forbid. Would, would the cabinet secretary be on leave also? The contempt that they are treating us, the contempt they treat people who are elected, Mr. Speaker, tells you, Mr. Speaker, that this country is on the brink. But let me just finish. Because in my anger, I might say something that might lead to things I don't want to say. 